Hey guys, what's going on? As always, it's Kyra Nankavell. Pretty low energy right now, as I always am after these. But hey, I'm smiling. You know, some people have been pointing out that I get sadder and just more tired looking in each of my YouTube thumbnails for this series. So I decided to smile today. Also because I had a great weekend. A lot of hard work, a lot of fun with the, with the other officer cadets and privates. So yeah, I mean, let me tell you about it. So on Friday, we got there. I don't remember exactly like the order or anything, but basically we set up the cot. We had some lectures. I was finding it very hard to stay awake during these lectures for some reason. But yeah, I was pretty dead. I had to stand up a lot because uh, that's what you do when you're falling asleep in lectures. You have to stand up and go to the side of the back of the class. So you stay awake. So I was doing that. Um, I had to redo one of the assignments that we submitted because I had some formatting errors, so I did that. And, oh, I wanted to say that there's a whole other course now at the same armory, so that's kind of cool. Now there's three active courses out of this armory, so we get to see what other people are doing, which is kind of fun, even though we're usually, well, mostly always preoccupied. But, yeah, still, still cool. Um, on Saturday, we had a six-kilometer ruck march. And because someone got their rifle stolen, we had to carry these like big water jerrys. So that was, that was, that made everything just shitty and like not smooth. Like you couldn't get in like a rhythm because we were having the slinky effect while we were walking, but we're also like dropping these heavy jerry things. And like, it was just like kind of a mess. It wasn't, it wasn't very impressive at all. Um, that was tough. Tough, not because, like, my, okay, this is a weird thing about me. This is a little side note. My legs were, like, okay. Like, my hip flexors get tired from carrying all this weight. It's not even that much weight yet, but just, I don't know. It's more than normal. Like, it's more than normal weight that you'd be carrying in your everyday life. So, anyways, yeah, but my upper body, like, is killing me. So, that was maybe one thing I would highly suggest to everyone. If you're in a position like me, and you're a lot stronger with your legs than you are with your arms and stuff, Maybe work on that just because my shoulders are killing me like they hurt they don't okay they don't hurt but they're very sore let's just say shoulders my back like I don't even think I use my back that much in everyday life like in terms of those muscle groups but holy crap they are sore today so we did that we did push-ups even at that March uh, on the ground in the cold windy wet dark atmosphere where the water was spraying on us the wind was super strong and what a beautiful day to be out for a ruck you know so that was fun I mean honestly I say it's like shitty and everything but like when you're when you get it done and when you're going back to the like back to the armory it's a good feeling I was laughing talking with the guys on the way back so that was nice morale was higher on the way back so <laughs> yeah um, then we had an inspection. I don't remember how that went, to be honest. Probably, like, meh, like usual. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure it was bad, because they told us it was bad. They told us everything this weekend was pretty much, like, not great. Room for improvement, let's just say. And then we did a firefighting kind of course slash lecture thing, which was great, too. Really interesting. I didn't know there was so much to know about fire. So, yeah, I did that. They actually brought in like a, kind of like a simulated fire thing. It's maybe like a four foot by four foot screen that has like fire on it. And then you have this fire extinguisher that has a laser and it simulates the sound too. So you can like put out the fire. So you like aim it at the base and you sweep and whatever else was in the acronym. <laughs> uh, and then we had rifle drills, but not like parade marching rifle drills, but more um, like hands-on with the weapons, clearing um, like stoppages and stuff like that. So we are learning those things. And the reason why you do drill, of course, is that it's just locked into your muscle memory and you can perform under stress, under pressure, you're sleep deprived, you're under attack, etc. You know what to do. It's just like instant response. So we did that a lot. <laughs> Spent a lot of hours doing drill on different stoppages. So, you know, if your cartridge gets stuck in your weapon or it's not um, oh, sorry, I'm so tired. I can't remember what the word is. 
Uh, but yeah, learned about that stuff, practiced it a lot. Then we had like actual drill on the, I don't know why I just called it actual drill, it's all actual <laughs> drill. We were on the parade square doing marching and then we went outside because we were shit. <laughs> and uh, yeah, marched around the parking lot, did some more push-ups on the cold ground. That was fun. But honestly it is fun because you get to push your limits a lot with a lot of people who are also doing the same thing and that's like it's like really shitty but also really empowering you know well maybe you don't know because i haven't really felt like that in regular life so that was interesting really cool experience shitty but super rewarding and really building our team cohesiveness i would say i made inspections like at that night because we were shit at drill i think that's why i mean who knows but uh, yeah, attention to detail, we're building that. So we had those inspections, I think we had two, a lot of standing, that's all I remember. Just standing and not moving is hard, it's hard. And they were going through our kit, they took, um, if our rain jackets weren't labeled, they put them in a big pile and then we had to figure it out later. So that was cool, I mean, <laughs> I didn't have mine labeled, so mine got thrown in the pile. Unfortunate, but we figured it out. Uh, and then we had to study because we had a performance check in the morning. So you have, I don't know how many, but like little tests. These ones are written. Pretty sure there's non-written ones later. Well, I know there are because you have to perform the drills. Um, and this one was on like the structure of the DND or, and or the CAF. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so we got up Sunday morning, did a mini ruck. Basically, I think it was under like 3K, walked around the armory, and um, we were doing a call, what was it called? Like two up was the command, two up. So that basically means that two people from the back run to the front. So we were doing like some mini sprints basically, and <laughs> I was killing it. I mean, I beat every guy. Oh, you shouldn't say B, it's not a race. But uh, <sighs> I was faster. But yeah, that was fun. I mean, I like sprinting, so. Um, but holy, my back muscles were so sore, so sore. Sunday morning, I was feeling it. Like, I'm working muscles that I didn't even know existed. My back, holy, it still hurts so much. Not, like, hurts, though. It's, like, just really sore, I guess. Whatever, it'll fix itself. <laughs> and then we had a rifle drill. Again, um, actually, no, this rifle drill was, like, on the parade square. Marching and such we learned some new things and then we had lectures and then we had a competition oh yeah we had a, co a friendly competition to do our our um service rifle drills like the clearing the stoppages and stuff like that so yeah that was fun i did it against one guy i screwed up but uh it was going pretty well until that mess up and i know what i did and i knew it when i did it so oh, it's a learning experience Definitely more pressure when you're pinned against someone though, but makes it a bit more realistic also to see if your your body really knows what to do like that fast, you know? You don't really think, because when you do something so many times, it just it just happens when you're in that situation. You keep practicing, keep practicing, keep practicing. Then when that situation occurs, you're just like, Z -Z 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 -Z. got it. So that was good. Uh, and then yeah, we probably did other stuff, but uh, that's that's the gist. Hope you guys like this video. Um, more to come. I'm really tired, but I've said that enough. Have a great rest of your Sunday. I don't know how many hours are left in this day, but enjoy them because the weekend's over. And have a great um, Monday through Friday and beyond.